If you want to attract bees to your garden, chances are you have consulted a plant list. Recent studies show that most plant lists were not developed based on science. This video will show you plants that have been proven by research to attract bees. We know pollinators use flowers for food. Butterflies and hummingbirds drink nectar, and bees need nectar and pollen. Some flowers are used by many kinds of pollinators, such as hummingbirds, beetles, and butterflies. When bees use these flowers, they face more competition. Yet other flowers are designed especially for bees. Good examples are flowers in pale to dark shades of purple and blue, and flowers in white with violet markings. This is because most bees see ultraviolet lights, so these colors and patterns really stand out. The best bee flowers allow bees to gather pollen and nectar with ease. Often, they are shaped to match a bee's body and flight pattern. Here are four types. Open platform flowers are arranged in the flat top or globe. Pollen and nectar are exposed and easily accessible. Pollen bowl flowers have a bowl or bell shape and is rich in pollen. Buzz adapted flowers, including tomatoes, lock in the pollen until they're buzzed by bees. Finally, plants with flowers arranged on stalks, spikes, or in close proximity, so a bee can go from flower to flower with the least amount of energy. Dr. Gordon Franke of University of California studied bees and flowers over decades. His work can cover plants that are proven to attract bees. Here are some examples you can find in local nurseries. California bees and plants overlap a great deal with those of Oregon, so Dr. Frankie's work is informative to us. Also useful is a local project at the Oregon State University North Willamette Research and Extension Center. Three years ago, Erin Anderson, a PhD student of the OSU Garden Ecology Lab, began to study native plants' ability to attract bees. This is the field where Erin put in 27 kinds of plants. 23 are Oregon natives. He counts bee visits to determine how attractive each plant is. The first two years show six native plants, Globigilia, California poppy, Douglas aster, goldenrod, Facilia, and Clarkia to be the best for attracting native bees. Oregano, a non-native, is best for attracting honeybees. In addition to planting the best bee flowers, other important gardening practices for a successful bee garden are provide a long season of bloom by planting a variety of flowers that bloom spring through fall, enable energy efficient foraging by planting flowers in large clumps, use easy to find flowers by planting in the sun and using blue purple flowers or white flowers with violet markings. Prolong bloom period by watering plants and removing spent flowers. Offer nesting areas by leaving patches of bare soil for 70% of all native bees to nest underground. And by leaving stumps, brush piles, hollow plant stems in the garden for those that nest above ground. 
practice integrated pest management by figuring out the problem before taking action. Plant disease-resistant varieties, monitor regularly, remove pest and diseased parts promptly, apply pesticides as a last resort, and follow the instructions on label.